Whether you're a professional photographer, a content creator, or simply someone who loves to enhance their visual content, you're in for an extraordinary treat. Get ready to witness the future of image editing right here, right now. Welcome to the A-Invasion channel. Today we bring you a game-changing episode that's about to revolutionize the way you see and create visuals. We will be unveiling not one, but two mind-blowing AI editing tools that will take your images and visuals to the next level. These tools are not just for experts, they're for everyone, and trust us when we say, they will blow your mind. Number 1. Photoshop Generative Filling Tool, Beta. Adobe has recently unveiled an innovative tool named Generative Fill. This groundbreaking feature empowers users to manipulate image content by simply using a text prompt. It simplifies the process of brainstorming ideas and enhancing existing images within the photo editing application. Generative Fill is also still in its testing stage, so, you'll need to install the Adobe Photoshop Beta, to gain access to the feature. Now, let's see what is possible. The initial step is to open an image from our pre-existing gallery. In this case, I will directly open it using Adobe Photoshop Beta. Once the image is open, we can proceed to enlarge it. We'll begin by using the crop tool to widen the image, extending it either to the left or right. Subsequently, we should select the newly created area using the rectangular marquee tool. This is where the real magic takes place. Locate and click on the Generative Fill button in the toolbar. It will prompt you to enter a prompt for what you wish to create. However, if you simply want to generate an image that seamlessly continues from the original, just press the Generate button. Impressive, isn't it? The level of accuracy is nearly flawless, and it will provide you with three options to choose from, allowing you to match the aesthetics you desire. In this instance, we chose the first option as the generated sky and sand blend perfectly with the original image. We will repeat the same process on the other side of the image. By following these steps, you can expand the image to your desired size. Let's see if we can capture the camel's legs. And the answer is yes. Once again, we can select from three different variations. Let's keep this one. Now, let me demonstrate what else is achievable with this generative fill tool. Using the lasso tool, you can select specific areas within the entire composition and add any element you can imagine. For instance, we want to add a piece of wood, so we type dry trunk, and the result is truly remarkable. However, we are not satisfied with just one element we want more. By drawing another area with the lasso tool and entering desert tree as the prompt, we are able to obtain this beautiful tree. I understand it may appear quite arid. But do remember, this is the desert. Here's the original image, and here's the image generated with the fill tool. Let's attempt this again with the same image, but with a different outcome in mind. First and foremost, we'll swiftly repeat the same process to expand the image, this time focusing on the left side. We've also added context below. Now, Let's explore what happens when we try to introduce some greenery or an oasis into the middle of the desert. Voila! We now have a forest. Would you like to see even more life? Well, you can add as many elements as you wish, such as these falcons searching for food. Here's the original image, and here's the image generated using the fill tool. Let's delve into another example using a different image. Begin by opening the image in Photoshop Beta. This time, we'll employ the Object Selection tool to isolate the car. Once the object is selected, click on Select Inverse in the toolbar below to choose the background, which is the part we want to alter. Now, a prompt is required for what you want to generate. Since we've had enough of the desert, let's go for something entirely different, a rainforest. Wow, that's quite unexpected. Let's select the best looking forest. Yes. Here it is. We actually want the forest to be larger, so by repeating the same process, we can expand the image. But this image lacks completeness without some wildlife. How about a leopard or two? And there they are. Here's the original image, and here's the image generated using the fill tool. Stay with us because, by the end of this video, 
you'll have two incredible AI tools at your fingertips that will elevate your visual creations like never before. But before we dive into the next tool, make sure to subscribe and hit that thumbs up button. You won't want to miss out on this revolution. Number 2. Adobe Firefly. Firefly represents the latest addition to the Adobe's family of creative generative AI models, soon to be integrated into Adobe products. Initially, its primary focus will be on generating effects within images and texts. Firefly is poised to introduce innovative approaches to ideation, creation, and communication, all while substantially enhancing creative workflows. For those who don't have an active Adobe Photoshop subscription, you can still access these tools online by simply typing Adobe Firefly into your search bar. Here, you can access several features for free, including generating stunning images from text prompts. Another interesting tool is for creating text with effects. Let's give it a try with this red fur and BA Invasion words. It's impressively accurate. You can generate the image in PNG with a transparent background or add any color of your choice, such as this elegant black. However, what truly captures our interest is the generative filling. You can upload an image from your current gallery, and in this case, we'll use this modern concrete house. By clicking the background button, you can remove the background. Since this image has numerous elements, you can refine it further by cleaning up areas you don't need with the add tool. Once it's neat, type in what you desire. In this case, we want this house to be situated in the California hills. You can also choose from the options, but we found the first one to be the best. In the next image with the same picture, we'll change an element that doesn't quite resemble a real tree. And there you have it, a tree that seamlessly blends into the natural surroundings. We believe this image could benefit from some human elements, perhaps a few kids playing around. And we weren't wrong. If you want to make the house larger, it's entirely possible. Simply select the area and enter your prompt. Even if we misspelled it, it worked smoothly. Let's see if we can eliminate that lake, we don't want the kids to fall into it. So, we'll create a roadside, which looks pretty amazing. Here's the original image, and here's the one generated with the filling tool. If you found this video insightful and thought-provoking, make sure to give us a like. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the notifications bell to join us on future explorations. Thanks, and see you in the next video.